Welcome back to the channel. My name's Tom and today I'm taking a look at a truly dead mall. This is the Galleria at White Plains. The mall was built in 1980 and it was announced just in December of 22 that the mall would close forever as of March of 23, which is just a few weeks from now. So if you want to get oh, yeah. out there and see it yourself, you don't have much time left. Today I'm joined by my mom and this is her first dead mall experience. Yeah, it closes in March. March. So next month. Wow. Look at that. Yeah, that's... Like that there's no music. This video was filmed on a Thursday around noontime in early February 2023 and as you'll see the mall is almost abandoned. I would guess maybe 75 to 85 percent of the stores are closed and there's pretty much nobody in the mall. The only real exception is in the food court but everywhere else as you'll see is almost completely empty. Here's a photo of what this part of the mall used to look like not too long ago, and the difference is striking. It's pretty clear that the mall is trying to save money at this point. As you can see, a lot of the lights are off. I think most of the light is coming from the skylights. And I think they've either turned off the heat or they've turned it way down. It wasn't bad on the top level here, but once we got down towards the lower levels, it was actually pretty cold. It was like being outside, actually. Even have the lights off. Yeah. Yeah, there's security there to the left. Let's wait and see which way he goes. Oh, wow. They still have a water fountain. like the elevator with the uh, sign at the top or the, I don't know what you call it, the neon. Right. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, leave a comment, and hit the notification bell. It helps a lot. Thanks.
straight ahead, this used to be Sears. Sears closed in 2021. Before that, it was JCPenney, which was the original anchor store. JCPenney closed in 2001, and then Sears moved in in 2003. I tried to take a look in the window to see if there was anything still left inside, but they have one of those black curtains up and you can't see anything. No, just a black curtain up. Can't see inside. No. Straight ahead, this used to be Old Navy. I don't know. It was kind of a scary laugh. Hmm? Yeah, you gotta get the whole level. We'll do this, then we'll go down and then... Sadly, the elevator is no longer operational, but here's a photo of what it used to look like. Hope the elevator's working. We can uh, take that back up at the end. It's down. Oh, shoot. All right. <laughs> Here's the H&M on the right. And I think H&M is the only large clothing store that's still open in this mall. Go down the escalators here. Yeah. Yeah, probably saving money by turning off the heat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the heat's definitely not on in here. 
As far as I can tell, this used to be Champ Sports. And of course, the GNC is still open. GNC and Bed Bath & Beyond, generally speaking, tend to be the last stores to close at a dead mall. This used to be the Macy's. The Macy's closed in 2021. And before that, it was Stearns from 1995 to 2001. Then Macy's moved in in 2001. And before that, the original anchor store there was Abraham and Strauss. That was there from 1981 to 1995. Yeah, that's all right. Your store here, a new start. Yeah. I don't think so. Not anymore. No. Here's what a vacant Spencer's Gifts looks like. Too bad. Would have been fun to go in the elevator. I think American Eagle used to be here on the right. Straight ahead, this also used to be Sears. Smells like a doctor's office in here or a dentist's office, and it's that weird. Yeah. You smell it? Yeah. It smells just like my dentist, though. Well, the dentist's office, not my dentist. There's a dentist office. 
It must be a dental smell of some sort. That's weird. Let's try and remember hmm. Yeah. All right, we'll just go up here and then down. An interesting fact I learned about this mall when I was doing research on it was that they actually filmed a movie in this mall. It was a movie called Eighth Grade, which I've never heard of. It came out in 2018, so I'm assuming they probably would have filmed it in 2016, 2017. Um, they had a lot of footage of the food court, but they also had some footage in front of this store here. As you can see, this is a still from the movie. And if you ever watch the movie, you'll notice uh, they have a shot of that girl there walking into the mall. But they actually filmed it at the Palisade Center Mall in West Nyack, New York. Not at this mall. kind of spooky this thing just started playing the music all by itself in the dark here just very strange <laughs> yeah. this was also Sears Sears actually took up a full three floors in this mall yeah I don't know. Yeah, it is. You want a throne? It looks like a throne there. $3,000. But 50% off, so it's a deal. Here's another still from that movie 8th grade and you can see that the restaurants are pretty much the same as they were in that movie. So they didn't rename any of the uh, restaurants or anything like that. like a fireplace or something. And here's another still from that movie 8th grade. You can see the holy guacamole there. And um, to the right of it is the Taco Bell. And then this yellow restaurant here at that time apparently was Wendy's.
let's head on down to what they call the Main Street level. Now, if I lived closer to this mall, I think I would be in this store all the time. This is Westchester Trains and Hobbies. Basically, it's a hobby shop. And you don't see many hobby shops in general anymore, especially in malls. It's a model train store. Yeah. Hess trucks. Buy one, get one half off. I think this is the first time I've ever seen a Hess truck in an actual mall. Usually I just see them at flea markets. Here's another rarity nowadays, a mall water fountain. As most of you know, back in the 70s and 80s, pretty much every mall had a water fountain in it. But nowadays, they're almost non-existent. I think the only mall in Connecticut, for example, that has a water fountain is the Stamford Town Center. And in Massachusetts, I believe I've seen maybe one or two so far. So they're pretty hard to find. And sadly, this one's going to be going away in a few weeks. As far as I can tell, this used to be the Forever 21. <clears throat> Their computer crashed. Yeah. <clears throat> Somehow I doubt anybody's going to fix that. Yeah. For some reason, the second fountain is turned off and there's no water in it. So there you have it. That is the Galleria Mall at White Plains in White Plains, New York. A truly dead mall. You could even say it's on death row. 
So if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, leave a comment, and hit the notification bell. I do plan to have a lot more mall videos in the future. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.